Hi everybody, I'm Janelle from Mom at the Meat Counter, and uh, one of the questions I get from time to time is about uh, meat color and why meat is red. And uh, sometimes people say, well, it's been treated to be red or it's under red lights, but what I want to let you know is that meat is bright red all on its own. Um, just like your blood in your arteries is bright red. Um, meat is bright red when it's, a, so when it's been exposed to oxygen. Um, so today I'm cooking some steaks for a class, so I thought this would be a great opportunity to talk about why meat is bright red. I've got a nice USDA inspected uh, strip loin here, and then I've got a second strip loin. And as you can see, they're packaged in two different ways. The top strip loin has been exposed to oxygen. This packaging allows the air to seep through the package and the oxygen to react with the meat, where this bottom steak is vacuum packaged, so it kind of has a purpley color. Um, the protein in the muscle that allows that meat to be red is very similar to the protein in blood that makes it red. Um, and so something I thought I would demonstrate, I've got a whole roast here, um, is you can see, well maybe you can see, the bright red color when you cut it. So we're going to cut a fresh roast and you can see, if you look really closely, how it's red on the edge where the oxygen has been penetrating into the muscle, but in the middle, it's kind of that purpley color. Um, that brown coloring that you see is from the uh, red turning back to purple. It has to go through a brown oxidative state to get back to that purple color because the meat is still breathing. It's still respirating. Those enzymes and proteins in the muscle are still doing their thing even though the animal is dead. So you can see bright red where the oxygen has been penetrating, purple where it's not. Same with the packaging. Bright red where oxygen's had access to it, purple where it's not. I hope this answers some of your questions and we will